Fall Out Boy are doing something today. They're doing something. This is an actual headline, guys. My. Awesome. Behold, breathe right clear and breathe right extra. It's like his snoring got so bad that his wife left him and now he's just forever alone with his extra strength breathe right strips. Maybe the strips are so effective that he inhaled his wife. Gentlemen, show them no shrimpathy. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Little game cubes resting in their natural habitat. Why would anyone need to own so many game cubes? Um, they aren't owned. They're wild game cubes. God, the Earth isn't flat. Correct. Huh? It's in the shape of an Italian car. What? Ah, oh, you read my name wrong, didn't you? Jeff, come on. We've been over this. Imagine a doctor driving by an apple orchard and hissing aggressively at it like a vampire. An apple farmer and a garlic farmer team up to fight their mutual nemesis. Duck Dracula. At any given moment, there is a shark behind you. It might be a thousand miles away, but there is a shark behind you. And that shark is totally behind you. It is supporting you in whatever you do and wants you to succeed. And he put up a picture of Sidon. That's your emotional support shark. When I stopped at a crosswalk today, this guy pulled up next to me, rolled his window down, and stuck his head out. At first, I was like, oh no, street harassment, here it comes. And then the guy was like, Dude, look at the huge rainbow behind you! The only appropriate thing for a dude to shout at me out a car window. I liked it before it was cool. Yeah, well, I liked it after it was cool when everyone abandoned it. Hmm? January is one of those months where you experience every feeling on the human spectrum and you just have to go about your day like it isn't happening. It's great! I want to decompose in a bog. Well, you clearly don't know the first thing about bogs, Cloud Chaser. In the bog is like the opposite of decomposition. Get pickled, idiot. Huge fan of the phrase, get pickled, idiot. Writing that one down. Once my hair is long enough to pull back into a gay little ponytail, oh, it's over for everyone past, present, and future. Mm. Several years ago, my spouse was like, you got to give the kitties a warning before you grind your coffee beans. And I was like, oh, okay, sure, makes sense. So now every morning before I grind coffee beans, I yell, it's going to get loud, baby. You got to grind some beans. And my spouse will yell back from the corners of the house in a despondent tone. Oh, no, the beans. Scattered. Mentai. Hi <laughs> for men. Why is this based on my likes? I think that one's on you, chief. Writing prompt. Thanks to a typo in the contract, the professor gained complete mastery of all the knowledge in the heavens and the earth in exchange for his soup. I don't know if I like that one more. That means I can never have soup again. Unless it's just one singular bowl of soup, but I feel like it's, you know, it's the devil. He's probably going to want more soup. It's been January for just a bit too long now. Starting to get suspicious. Tonight, my darling, we will be dining on my finest china. Ribbit. Ribbit, zoo pals. God, that song is forever stuck in my head. And you did copyright reasons we can't play the full song. Play just one second of the song now. Buzz two. When you see the phrase, ooh ee -oo, if the first thing you think of is Miku, you're going to heaven. And if it's Weezer, you're going to hell. <laughs> Monkey.